Hello guys, it's Deep Show over here and today I'm going to show you how to put text behind subject and blend it with the wall in Photoshop. Also, if you want to learn how to create amazing effects using Photoshop, then hit that subscribe button if you haven't already. So without wasting any time, let's get started. So the first step over here is we need to place in the text. So for that, select horizontal type tool and then select any font of your choice. Download link for the font I am selecting is in the description below as well as if you don't know how to install font in Photoshop, link for that is in the description as well. Then set any appropriate size for the font. And then set the foreground color as the color of the font you want. And then click on OK. After that click on the image and then type in the text. After that click on this tick icon to place it. Now using move tool place the text properly. And then press ctrl plus T to scale the text. Press shift while scaling to scale evenly. So this seems good now, then click on the stick icon to place it. Now we want that this text be behind of the subject over here, so for that hide the text layer by clicking on the eye icon and then make the background layer active by clicking on it. After that using quick selection tool, select the subject in the image behind which you want the text. Now if you want to deselect the selection, then click on this minus icon over here and then using the brush tool, deselect that selection. Now again if you want to select something, then click on this plus icon over here. Now once the selection is complete, click on this refine edge over here and then using the brush hover over the edges to smooth it out. After that click on OK. Now once the selection is complete then make the text layer active by clicking on it and then unhide it. After that click on add layer mask icon which will only keep the portion of the text that is under the selection and remove the rest of the text. Now we want the opposite of this that is the text that was under the selection not to be visible and then the text that was outside the selection to be visible. So for that press ctrl plus i to invert the mask. Now as you can see we have placed the text behind the subject but now we have to blend it with this wall to make it more realistic. So for that make the text layer active by clicking on it. And then click on add layer style icon and select blending options over there. Now drag the black underline layer from left to right. Now as you can see as we drag this slider, the black portion of the wall blends in with the text. After that drag the white underline layer from right to left. As you drag this slider, the white portion of the wall blends with the text. After that press Alt and click on this black underline layer slider which will divide the slider. Now drag the right portion of the slider more towards right. After that press Alt and click on this white underline layer slider which will divide it and drag the left portion of the slider more towards left. So once it looks proper then click on OK over here. Now reduce the fill of the text a little to make it look more proper. So now the text looks perfect over here but if you still want to move the text using move tool then this is what will happen. So 
strategy moves the text, the mask moves along with it, but we don't want like this way. So press Ctrl plus Z to undo the step and then click on this chain icon over here to make the text independent of the mask. And now using move tool, move the text. So as you can see, as you move the text, it takes the shape of the subject. So now that's it guys now hope you guys like this video and if you guys like this video then hit the like button also share it to the ones who might be interested in such videos and subscribe to the channel for more videos in photoshop thanks for watching bye bye